also developing today, there's been another twist in the investigation into the murder of an Osceola mother, Nicole Montalvo. Her estranged husband, father-in-law, and mother-in-law, they're already facing charges. Now another relative has joined them. Montalvo's brother-in-law arrested in Georgia and now considered a person of interest in her murder as well. Sydney Cameron live in Osceola County this morning with the very latest. A lot going on here, Sid. Good morning to you. Good morning. It is a very convoluted case indeed, Danielle. Osceola deputies say they were able to get that brother-in-law arrested on unrelated child pornography charges, but make no mistake, they say he is a person of interest in Montalvo's murder, and deputies expect to add more charges against him. Nicholas Rivera arrested in Georgia on eight counts of child pornography. U.S. Marshals tracking him down after Osceola deputies say they found evidence to bring the charges while investigating Nicole Montavo's disappearance. We once spoke with him, we were able to obtain his uh, cell phone. And that's how we got the information for the uh, current charges of the child pornography. Osceola Sheriff Russ Gibson saying Rivera is now a person of interest in Montavo's murder. He says Rivera lived at the house where Montavo's mutilated remains were found. Rivera now the fourth person to be named in connection to her murder. Rivera's brother, Montavo's estranged husband, already facing murder charges along with his father. Rivera's mother is charged with lying to deputies and tampering with evidence. Deputies now working to extradite Rivera from Georgia. If we have to obtain a governor's warrant from the state of Florida to bring him back here, he's coming back here. He's going to face every charge that we're going to place on him. The sheriff says this is one of the most gruesome cases he has worked in his 30 plus years in law enforcement. And because of that, he will personally ask prosecutors to seek the death penalty. Reporting live in Osceola County, Sydney Cameron, Fox 35 News.